I'm John. I'm Mohammed. And this is the 10 minute challenge. Let's go. All right. So the first shot's gonna be a little slow because I don't have anything prepped here. This is not cheating. And I'm gonna weigh out 15 grams of beans. Now what I'm trying to do is get good at this scoop so that as I do this a few more times, this weighing process is a little bit faster. So I'm getting within 0.3 grams each time. Okay. I'm leaving the portafilter locked in. That's me forgetting to do a cleanup of the previous one. <laughs> But you can see it's pretty fast to clean it up. All right, what I want to also do is start weighing the next dose. John, what some. profile are we using here? This is the Londinium profile, which is my favorite profile for making what I call chocolate plus flavor. So it's chocolatey mm. with something else. In this case, it's got a little bit of floral stuff going on. And um, it's a kind of long shot. It takes about 35, 40 seconds. Okay. In total. Okay. And we'll just get that. I also noticed that you're not letting the grind finish the grinding, right? That's right. So the grinder at the very end is going to be a bit slow to get the last bits out. Mm. And that's just kind of the way this grinder works. So it's going to go into the next one, basically. Yep. Exactly. Oh, that's a perfect 15. Sometimes nice. I get lucky. And as I do this more, <laughs> I'm gonna get that weight a little bit more accurate. Nice. Okay. So as that's grinding and getting prepared, I'm gonna get my next dose ready. Okay. And you start to get a feel for how many beans you need to get out yeah. in order to do that right. And I'm just gonna to toss that in there so that that is ready to go. And you can see I'm not yet running in parallel, okay? And not fast enough yet to keep up with the espresso machine. So what I'm gonna do is lock that in here and there. Nice. Now this machine on the right is our latest model. So there's our first espresso. Mm. And then that right there. Does the machine on the right uh, brew a little faster? Uh, they should be the same at this point. Okay. Are we looking at the graphs and learning something here? Um, at this point, because this is fully automated, in other words, mm. I'm trying to go fairly fast, um, I'm not really looking at the, ch the chart. Mm. I'm just trying to get to a point where I can have both machines making espresso at the same time. And we're not there yet, but we're getting better. Cause like right now, I'm managing to at least start this one. There you go. Okay. Now we have two machines in action. That goes there, not quite. I imagine you would want, when this happens, the pouring is finished, that you would want another one ready, right? Yeah, I'd want to get to a point where I didn't have any pauses. Mm. Now, I am waiting for a bunch of things here. So this weighing uh, thing here is a little bit slow. Mm. Now, now I'm taking a bigger scoop. I'm never sleeping for the whole weekend <laughs> after Zero. this. Because this is not going to waste. I'm drinking all of it. Okay. <laughs> and off we go. So I am keeping both machines busy, or at least um, that. Obviously, I need cups. There. I love this setup, man. The espressos look nice, though. Yep. All right. Need to dry that, otherwise it's not going to be good. And going to go. Okay, so All right. I'm, we are at four minutes. Four You're minutes. doing well. How many espressos have we done in four minutes? Uh, four. All right. So we need to do a little bit better. Mm. Let's see if we can crank up the speed here. So what I'm doing each time here is I'm grinding and then I'm organizing <clears throat> the grounds so that the espresso is not going to channel. So it's a good espresso. I think that's the second time that beans have ended up on the floor. <laughs> so. Just one, it's fine. Okay. 
and I haven't quite worked out my workflow because you see what I did is I prepped those beans and I forgot that I had prepped them. Mm. But nonetheless, now I've got one quarter filter charging. Clean that. Get that ready there. Okay. Now we're getting a little bit better because as I put that there in you there go. and take that out, I can do that. Right there. That is also spent. I think here we can start one. I forgot to start that. Mm -hmm. okay. This is imitating basically a very busy coffee shop environment. This should be a busy coffee shop environment and also one where the barista is not really up to snuff, right? I don't quite have my workflow together. Mm. So I'm kind of doing different stuff each time. To be fair, the barista usually does not have an annoying guy just asking them what they're doing the whole time. I think they so. usually do, actually. <laughs> uh, I think those cafes... I'm not even a customer. <laughs> customers asking through the whole process. Well, yeah, but they're not in their workspace. <laughs> just sure. roaming around them. What are we at? And also counting their espressos. All right, how, what are we at? Six minutes 30. Nice, right. nice. Uh, we're six to six right now, so... Okay. Goddamn. What I think I need to do is I need to get grinding a little sooner. Mm. Right? Because the grinding with this grinder is not super fast. Mm. So there's another quarter filter. Mm. All right, we're at... It, almost exactly seven minutes. Mm -hmm. Three minutes ago, I think the challenge now is gonna be getting up to 10. So, so one a minute. That noise that we hear mm. is the water tank refilling in the background on the espresso. Ah. And hopefully there is plenty of water, otherwise we're definitely gonna have a slower challenge. Well, there's usually an indicator here, it goes red, right? And it's yeah. not red, so we're good. Seven. So All right. This is exciting. Now it's like watching a football game. <laughs> Can he do it? No, he can't, but that's okay. You're going to vote for the other dog anyway. <laughs> All right. how, how are we doing on time here? Uh, we are uh, 7.50. Okay. Let's put that there. There. And that next one there. All right, and we're at seven, almost eight. So you have two more and two minutes. Man, this is exciting. <laughs> <laughs> is it evil that I'm just enjoying watching you being stressed? That's fine, you can get revenge on me. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna put you up here soon enough. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. last few yeah because these take a few seconds to make uh, I'm not necessarily going to be able to so you basically need to squeeze one more in aside from these two okay. six seven eight nine yep one more and you have one minute 20 seconds left all right well, let's see what we can do at the limit of what I can do. Uh, you need a cup here. I do need a cup. Yes. Yeah. There you go. Woo. All right, good save. And I think we're good. I think we're gonna make 10. You have 30 seconds left. There is already nine cups and one is pouring. Let's watch this one and see if we can actually get it on time. Okay, that's one I'm gonna give up as. I think you'll make it, dude. 9.40. All right. One, two, three, four, really count five, six, seven, eight, count. nine. You're already at 10. 
And it's 950 seconds, so that's impressive. Okay, well, that's as much as we're gonna do. We've got and shot. 10 minutes. Right. So we have how many espressos? I'm averaging one espresso a minute, starting from nothing, right? That means weighing, spilling beans on the ground, <laughs> fetching glasses over here. I think if we optimize this, we can probably speed it up a bit. I can't wait for the YouTube comments going, look, what the hell is this guy doing? Like, yeah. why is he there? <laughs> I think the main comment will be, shouldn't he have practiced more? Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about me. Why am I there? <laughs> you're, the, you're the distractor. That's true. All right, yeah. Well, thank you for watching. Yeah. Uh, right now, we are at one espresso per minute, and we will do variations on this with milk, with one machine, uh, with people who are maybe even more distracted. <laughs> wave at them. Yeah. yeah. Tune into the future episodes. Thank you. Thanks, guys.